This is a video tutorial for the new Velocitech Pro Start running firmware version 40. Firmware version 40 was released in early April 2022 and firmware version 40 is only available on the new Velocitech Pro Start. Um, we'll start by turning on the device. And then we'll get into the user configuration menus by pressing and holding the reset button. Uh, one thing you'll notice here is a reorder of the configuration menus. In this first menu here, we've got the direction output, uh, heading versus cog, and that can be toggled with the line set buttons. And we're gonna leave it at heading and move along to the next menu. Next menu is the bar graph output. We've got heel selected here and we, we like that. So we'll press the gun button, confirm the selection and move on to the next menu. Uh, this third configuration menu is the damping level. You see D level scrolling at the top. We've got it set to zero. We're happy with that for this, for this demonstration and we'll keep going. And this menu is the heading offset um, in case your pro start is mounted out of alignment with the center line of your boat you can dial in that offset in this menu here zero is good for us for the time being we're looking to get to the end of the configuration menu so onwards uh, this is the default declination uh, or the the magnetic declination we've got it set to the factory default with which is an auto lookup um, it works really well. There's really no reason to play with this setting, um, but it's a it's an option in case you need it. So we'll press the gun button once more, and this brings us to the bow offset, and we're gonna leave it at 0.0, .0 meters for this, and go to the next menu. This is your distance precision, uh, distance to line precision. We're gonna leave it at 0.0, .0 so showing tenths uh, for this for this video. And then distance to line, we're gonna leave that on and just keep going. So here's here's the new feature for, uh, for firmware version 40. It is the bonus screen. Uh, you see bonus screen scrolling across the top. And then in this configuration menu, it's just toggling the bonus screen on and off. So right now the bonus screen is set to off. If we press the gun button, with uh, with the bonus mode off, it'll just return to normal operation, and you know you'll have race mode and start mode, and, and the pro start works as you as you know. Um, if we turn bonus mode on, which we can toggle on and off using the line set buttons, um, we'll turn it on here, and we can save the on selection using the gun button. Once we save that selection, it goes to the bonus mode configuration menus. Um, in the bonus mode, you can numerically display any piece of data that uh, that is available on the Pro Start. Um, we had users requesting a heading versus cog mode. That is the 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 factory uh, default, if you will, for the bonus screen. Um, so if you want to compare your heading to your course, you can do that here. And so you select the top line of data and the bottom line of data, you select them independently. So you can set them to whatever pro start data you like. And we'll, uh, we'll scroll through some of the options here. So we've got heading and then heel. If we wanna go back to heading, we just press the triangle button. So this, this moves us through the list, uh, you know, up or down, right or left, but the, the buttons are directional. So one takes you forward through the list. The other goes back in case you wanted that last selection. So we'll run through the selections here. We got heading, heel, pitch, shift and that's your that's your wind shift from the uh, 
it's it's the same the same shift that's on the bar graph. It's just going to display it numerically uh, on the top line of data in this instance. So we'll we'll keep going. So we see all the options: shift, then cog course over ground, the direction you're moving, and then after cog, we've got sog speed over ground. So sog and cog is not particularly interesting for the bonus mode because we already have that in the race mode. So you know, let's let's set it to heading cog and you know, we're happy with heading for the top line. So we'll press gun to move on to the bottom line and the same data is available top and bottom. So we're not going to run through that menu again. Um, let's say we want to do a heading cog mode and then yeah, heading cog compare compare the direction we're aiming the direction we're pointing to the direction we're moving. Uh, what's what's the tide doing, or uh, or what's how does our heel angle affect our uh, the difference between health, the heading and cog? So, you know that that brings up the next question. Well, what about heel? Uh, we'll press the gun button, and that brings up the bonus menu bar graph. You know it's the bar graph because the bar graph is scrolling, and then we've got the bar graph data. On the bottom line, uh, we've got heel, off, and shift as our three options. Um, we're going to go back to heel. So we've just created this bonus screen, which has heading on the top line, cog on the bottom line, and heel on the bar graph. That's a pretty useful bonus screen um, for, for testing and for practice. Uh, might not be the most useful thing in races, but it is, it's, it's going to be super useful data for you for, for training purposes. And it's, uh, it'll, it'll help you learn your boat. And it was, it was commonly request or yeah, it was requested by users. So we're, we're bringing this to you in this new bonus mode and to save these configurations, we're going to press the gun button once and return to normal operation. So. Now that we're back in normal operation, how do we get to the bonus screen? Well, to get to the bonus screen, you press the mode and the plus one button at the same time. So here we are in the bonus mode. Um, we are, we're indoors, we're not moving. So the course over ground is three lines. We don't have a course because we're not moving. But here we are with course on the bottom, heading on top and heel on the uh, on the bar graph, so heel uh, is is zero because there's because the boat's not heal or the table's not healing, and here we are. We'll, we'll just add a little heel angle back and forth so you can see that it is in fact heel. All right, so there it is. That's the new bonus screen on the new Pro Start. You can display cog or heading heel or pitch, get, get vessel attitude, any piece of data you want on the new Pro Start can be displayed numerically in the bonus screen. And from bonus screen, you can return to race mode or start mode, whatever you were last in by pressing the mode button. And that's the top left corner. Um, and just like the, the Pro Start in race mode, if you press any of the line set or start related buttons, line set, gun, whatever, the pro start will automatically switch to start mode, record the pings, record the gun. So it's just, uh, it's just a, a new little Easter egg feature in the all new pro start with firmware version 40. Thanks very much for watching.